Hello and welcome. My name is Chuck. I'm Old Man Tarot. I do daily tarot readings. Every day we ask the cards, what are our opportunities for the day? This is a reading for Wednesday, October 12th. Wednesday, October 12th. What are our opportunities for today? Please, if you like these readings, share with a friend, like, subscribe, and follow. That way no one will miss any of these exciting daily readings. All right, let's see what the cards have to say for Wednesday. First card, High Priest. This was the last card yesterday. Uh, if we're a member of a large group, they want us to conform. They want us to spread the word of that group, uh, reach out and try to recruit some other members and get them in the group as well, but mostly spread the good word. If this is a church, if this is an educational organization or a medical organization, reach out into the community and try to help others as much as you can. Uh, four of Pentacles, this is a card of kind of being stingy. You're walled off from people that are in need. Looks like we have plenty. We have plenty of... Uh, money, you have some potatoes and some wood. These people look hungry and cold. So uh, again, reach out in the community. Uh, don't wall yourself off. Reach out in the community, help people as much as you can. If you're a member of a large organization, uh, try to join a group that's help reaching out and helping people. But right now you're walled off from people and you're not, you're not real happy. Eight of Pentacles, we got lots of work to do. We're very skilled in our work. Uh, we can create a lot of work in a short period of time, and it's very excellent, skilled work. So we're going to have to do some work midway through the day, but we're good at it. We please the boss when we're doing it, and uh, we'll just keep continue working until all the work is done. Ten of Swords, we're faced with a harsh truth uh, late in the day. Uh, something we thought was true is not, or uh, when we find out the truth, it's not what we hoped it was seems to stab us, stab us in the back and make us bleed. We're able to get up, we're able to walk away, we're able to move towards the next day, but something, some harsh truth will come around uh, late, later in the day, Wednesday, that uh, hurts us. Then finally, the chariot. Uh, that harsh truth may also set us three, free. Uh, we have now have a clear path, we're on a clear path. We've had a recent success. We feel like we're in control of our path and in control of where we're going, and we're gonna continue on that path until we uh, get to uh, our final destination. Early in the day, I think we need to reach out in the community as much as we can and help. Uh, there's people out there that are in need. Uh, winter's coming up. It's getting cold. Try to reach out. Try to feed people. Try to make sure they have good shelter. Try to make sure they have enough money for heat and food. If we're a member of a large organization, uh, use that organization's power to reach out into the community even further. Uh, midway through the day, we're going to have to keep working. We have a lot of work to do. We have, uh, we're very skilled and very good at our work. So whatever work we do, uh, we were able to get it done. We were able to get it done correctly and please the boss. Late in the day, there's some harsh truth that comes around, but somehow that harsh truth frees us up. Um, this is something we were holding on to. We we're able to let go of it now, walk away. Once we do that, we have to see a very clear path as to where we're going. We feel like we're in control of ourselves, in control of our chariot. We're gonna get to that path. As long as we control our minds and keep a positive mental attitude, anything is possible. My name's Chuck. I'm Old Man Tara. Thank you for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.